What is up guys? Welcome back to the channel. Thank you for tuning in. Today we are going to continue with the lighting upgrades for the C5 Corvettes. Bringing this car up to 2023 standards. Last week we did every single light on the rear of the C5. And that would be including the side marker lights, all four tail lights, the fifth brake light, license plate lights up underneath and the reverse lights and if you don't remember or you didn't see the video which i don't know why you didn't there you go that's what it looks like so personal opinion looks good posted this on facebook i got hated on by probably every guy over the age of 45 saying the stock lights look better i personally disagree i think this looks freaking awesome so today what we're doing Today we're going to be replacing, oh yeah, by the way, I bought some meats, bought some meats for the C6 Z06 wheels. But back to what I was saying, last week we did all the lights on the ass end of the car, if you will. Today, just to complete the look, because I wanna get these wheels and tires on the car ASAP. But the only thing that's going to stand out now at that point would be these freaking front corner lights. Now, I don't have new headlights in yet. Like I said, those are still gonna probably take a couple weeks to come in, but the flip up function, man, so they're down. So you can't even tell that they don't have updated lights. And I'll let you guys in on a little secret. I'm actually going to also be picking up a different exhaust today, and I do have powder coated black tips on that exhaust so let's go so we're going to continue our lighting mods with vet lights these guys once again are pretty freaking awesome and these are the front corner lights that we're going to be replacing from the factory oem one so from my understanding they are a switchback function so we'll see how that works when we put the turn signals on and whatnot and we do have some small resistors to mount on each light just for well, so that way they don't hyper flash. And once again, these lights are plug and play. This plugs into the old bulb. This would be for the resistor itself. And it should be a fairly straightforward mod. So all we gotta do is get the car, like the front end of the car, up in the air a little bit. We'll pop those bad boys out, put these bad boys in, see what it looks like, and then uh, we'll go from there. So one light is done and god dang does it look good. Just like, just the appearance right now, it's smoked out compared to this old 1990s lens. Now, if we turn the lights of the car on, which we will do, bam. Turn the lights of the car on and it makes such a difference. Look at that. Look how nice and bright that is. So obviously white, white up front, amber right down there for the side marker versus literally all just amber. And then if I turn the blinkers on or flashers, whatever you want to call it, if I turn the blinkers on, look how sick that is. Look how sick that is. Oh, that looks so good compared to just like that. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Look at that. Looks like a freaking American flag every time you turn your turn signal on. That looks good. So either way, not gonna bore you guys. That these This was a lot more difficult than I thought it was going to be. There's just such limited space up underneath to put your hands and everything like that. So overall, not crazy, not terrible. The funny thing is I still did not put the resistor box in. There's no resistor box in and it's not hyper flashing, so interesting. I am gonna mount that though anyway, just because I don't wanna ever have to go back up underneath. But look at this, compared to that. Lame and boring, 1990, 2023, sweet and sexy. See you guys when it's all done.
I wanna be the best in the game, invest in my name Check no restraints, I'm obsessed with the pain I ingest, I retain, assess and I change Possessed by the thought I'll be free one day From society's restraints, money, clout and fame Mud disease, a plague, we all love to hate Have to play the game, have to make a name All our insecurities are on This display. is war with the enemy Think that it was meant to be Living in a time where disease is on every screen I won't let them fester me I know most are festering Negativity is a plague for the mentally all right guys, what do you think about the new front corner assembly lights on the C5? I personally think they look friggin' phenomenal. So at this point now, we have every exterior light of the car upgraded except for the headlights, the flip up headlights. And we'll get to that here soon. And personally, I think that is gonna be the sickest mod yet. Real quick, like I said, I think they look awesome. They look a lot more modern and updated even when they are off. And then when we throw the flashers on, when we throw the flashers on, they have a really sick switchback feature in and honestly, they complement, in my personal opinion, once again, they complement the new tail lights from Vet Lights so much as well. Those look absolutely fantastic. Now, with that being said, I did want to keep this video as short as possible because I don't want to bore you guys. The lighting mods for the exterior are now completely done, except for the headlights, of course. I got a lot of fun videos on the Corvette for you guys. Like, I want to do every interior light here in the soon. We'll have the new headlights. We'll have the black wheels and tires on. We will have some exotic notes that are gonna be changing we got a lot of fun stuff and I know a lot of my truck people are like John where the hell's the truck like this is not what I subscribed for and I apologize but I'm still freaking truckless so this is what I have right now to make some content on and honestly I'm freaking loving it so I hope most of you guys are as well so like the video if you haven't already subscribe join the channel join the Corvette content and we'll see you guys next week peace